Hi, baby. Hi, guys. I'm here with my fluffy, with my trusted, my sweet baby Mishka. She's always following me around, especially when I cook. So say hi. Oh, now she wants her belly rubbed. <laughs> um, I love cookbooks and I definitely appreciate all the time and attention and um, curiosity and the experiments that go into putting together a cookbook. So I adore supporting the people who are in my industry, in the health industry and that uh, that create incredible things and I really want to show my support. So today I wanted to share this beautiful cookbook that I came across. This is the Laura Lee Balanced Cookbook and let me tell you, I think that she's absolutely stunning. Just look at this, just and just like as beautiful as she is on the outside, I think that everything that she creates, it just it just shows through. So let me share with you why I fell in love with this cookbook. So it starts off with this introductory section where she takes you through the class classifications of recipes. There's gluten-free and paleo and dairy-free options. <laughs> My Mishka. And uh, it gives you different specifications, classifications of the recipes. And then it, it takes you through the pantry essentials section. Then the first, the first recipe section, which I'm obsessed with the name, is called snack appetizers. And just look at this, these rosemary roasted pecans. I can just smell these from the page. It's such gorgeous photography, by the way. That's one of those things that I look at when I find beautiful cookbooks is the food photography. And let, let me tell you, I love food photography myself and I know the time that goes into setting up every shot. So it's beautiful, great job. Next section is beverages and smoothies. And what I love is the concept of the wor workout water have to try that. It looks really, really yummy. Mishka, what do you think? You like this? Mm. So the next, you go right into the breakfast section and there's all kinds of delicious stuff here. Look at these pancakes. <laughs> it makes you want to just put everything into your shopping list and go to the grocery store and start cooking. Now, interestingly in love, after the breakfast day section, there's a bakery section. So from breakfast, you can jump right into brunch and there's all kinds of breads in here and even cakes. From that, the next section is sides and there's all kinds of sides, there's salads, there's uh, her go-to recipe for roasted veggies. So it's an interesting structure. It's, it's, it's a little bit different from the traditional structure that you would think where you go, a breakfast and then lunch and then dinner and then sides and then cakes so you'll have to you'll have to see it but but it, this flows so after the side section it, it goes through the uh, lunch and dinner entrees and then there are sections for meats and poultry and uh, seafood and then vegetables what attracts me is I cannot wait to try this quinoa lentil pizza crust two ways So, following the lunch and dinner entrees section, oh my gosh, I cannot get over how beautiful these pictures are. So the next section is desserts. So amazing and delicious. And like I said, I'm obsessed with the photography in this book and it's, it just it makes you wanna immediately test the recipe. So overall, I would definitely recommend this cookbook if you are looking to add some beautiful, healthy recipes into your regimen. Make sure that you look through the entire cookbook. You'll probably select three to four recipes that you're gonna wanna jump in and try out immediately. Great job, Laura.
Thank you for tuning in. Mishka and I were very happy to review this book for you and we invite you to live a deliciously healthy life. We're probably gonna go make some fresh doggy treats now.